Hey everybody. Thanks for joining me. I really wanted to come out to Hot River View at Kanaka Creek Regional Park. Because there are some really cool trees here I want to photograph. This is what I want to photograph. I'm going to be shooting uh, 8x10. I got my Canon 8x10, so I'm going to be shooting some HP5 and some JNC Classic. So I'm going to get set up and then I'll show you the exact composition that I'm after. Let's go! set up. I'm going to be switching the bellows out to a wide angle uh, bag bellows to accommodate wide angle lenses. That's a pretty easy switch. It just pops out. What would you like to do? Sorry. And that's my wide angle. And my bag bellows. Just it in. Just make sure it's all the way in. No vignetting. And put the back on. And my composition closely resembles what you see on the screen. It's not as rectangular, of course. The left frame ends around there, where I have it. And the right frame about there. That's pretty darn close, I would say. We see a little bit more on the bottom, and perhaps a tad more up above. Now, metering is going to be a bit of a challenge, because the contrasts are quite extreme, right? So I, I don't want this tree to go black. So I may base my exposure on this tree and I'll probably give it just enough exposure to get enough detail. And I'll have probably have to curtail my development time to you know control extreme brightness out there. I gotta sort of move quick because the sun is gonna pop out around and it's like seven and a half stop different so I'm going to put that bit of the tree on zone 3 and I'm going to cut back about in minus 2. So one second, two seconds at f8 is my base and I'll have to compensate for reciprocity. f8, I'm going to put that on zone 3 so F8, 11, 16. So actually I'm gonna, I'll put that on 22. And that becomes four seconds, so it's actually gonna be a six second exposure. Cock the shutter. Out with the slide. Just make sure, ooh, ground's not level. Get the metronome going. Okay, so I've shot two sheets of HP5, two sheets of this JNC classic stuff. That's it, I'm gonna pack up and I'm gonna go home. I might develop a sheet tonight, we'll see how I feel. And I'm probably gonna try it in that 510 Pyro developer that I 
mixed up recently. Thanks for hanging out with me, guys. I really do appreciate it. It's kind of better than being by myself. Take care, guys. See you later.